everyone, Ali here. Well, I'm just going to make a, um, a special card for a special lady. So, my best friend, it's her birthday coming up, so I thought I'd make a card for her. So, I've got this beautiful paper here, and it's butterflies, and it's from the We Are Memory Keepers paper pad which I actually bought not long ago and it's called Typecast. So it's a 36 piece um, book and it's absolutely beautiful. So it's got a lot of foiled um, pages in it and I saw this and absolutely beautiful. So it's got um, like pinks, golds, bronze, and a little bit of navy in it. So we are memory keepers. So I'm going to use the butterfly today. And this is what it looks like. It's absolutely gorgeous. Sorry for the glare. <laughs> but I just wanted to use a little bit of this uh, for the front of the card. I've actually got some butterfly die cuts here that I purchased from AliExpress that I'm going to use as well um, and I've got a embossing folder and it's dots by craft concepts classic collection so I'm just going to use um, that I've got my go-to label dies here which I'm going to put a banner on and I'm going to put a sentiment on the front and I think I'm going, I don't know what I'm going to do. I love the birthday curl or happy birthday. I'm just not sure what, uh, which one I'm going to use just yet, but that'll probably go on a little later. I'm also going to use some em gold embossing powder. Just on, when I emboss this, I'm going to just run a little bit of em uh, Versamark around the outside. Just going to put a bit of gold on and heat set it so that should tie everything together. Now it looks like it's rose gold and I don't have rose gold so I'm hoping that's going to be okay so we'll see what happens anyway. So I'm going to begin and I hope you enjoy uh, my finished product. So I've started out by embossing a white piece of cardstock with this uh, dotted embossing folder and I'm just running the Versamark around just two sides at the moment and just dipping the gold embossing powder just on the edge I just want that subtle um, finish so I don't know how this is going to turn out because on closer look of the butterflies they are rose gold so I'm not sure if this is going to turn out or not but uh, I'm just going to do it and just then see how it looks. So now I've embossed the whole lot, I'm just going to see how it's going to look on the card. And while I'm here, I'm just going to put this on the black cardstock here. So when I look at it, I'm not really happy with it. So I'm going to go to my embossing box and I'm um, just looking for my black fine powder or if there's anything else in here that I could use. Uh, as well so I end up getting the black and using the black uh, and this is the Zing embossing powder so I've embossed another white piece of cardstock <laughs> with the dots and I'm just going around with the black embossing powder So after doing that, I'm going to do a bit of a comparison and I'm 
liking the black more so than the gold. So I'm really going to have to get some rose gold embossing powder. So now I'm going to do the butterflies and I've die cut out some butterflies just in black cardstock and I'm just tracing around the metal butterflies on some clear vellum so just with a fine sharpie pen and then I'll just fussy cut these out Now the vellum butterflies are going to be a little bit bigger than my die cut butterflies and what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my Versamark pen with the brush tip and I'm just going around the edge of the vellum and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add some of that black embossing powder to the edge just to bring it all together. some glue to the back of the black die cut butterflies and just on the body part and just put them on the vellum. And I'm just going to put those aside to dry. And just while I've got my embossing powder out I'm um, changed my mind totally and I've used a different stamp set so this is from Aliexpress the stamp set uh, and it's a beautiful uh, font on this so it just says happy birthday and I've got my we are memory keepers uh, stamping tool here and I'm just going to use the clear embossing powder and just heat set that so what I'll do eventually is I'll just cut that out of my banner dies So I've just used some foam tape just to put my little happy birthday sentiment down and all there is now to do is just to stick down my butterflies and I'm just using some glossy accents for that. So I'm calling my card done for this one. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this. I think it turned out really well, but I will have to get some rose gold embossing powder. So I'll put that on my wish list, I think. Um, 
If you have enjoyed this process video, please give me the thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell. And until next time everybody, happy crafting! See ya! Oh,